welcome. We are here at the Hardware and Software Expo at our Telematics Vilnius. And here we are with Valerie. Valerie, how are you? Fine, thank you. Thank you. Now I'm doing all right. Can you tell us a little about what, uh, what you got going on here, the IoT project of the year? Uh, we're providing the competition now, IoT project of the year to 2022. It's the third time we're doing this competition. And every partner can compete and submit his project. We will evaluate it and provide the competition and pronounce the winners. <laughs> Excellent. And when is the deadline for this competition? Um, deadline was already uh, some time ago, but for the partners who participate in the conference, it was prolonged, prolonged till the 1st of September. Okay, great. And how many um, submissions can a partner make? Can they make multiple submissions or is it just one? At the moment, uh, we've got uh, 30 plus submissions uh, already, but after the conference, we'll counting on much more. <laughs> Excellent. And how will these uh, uh, cases be judged? Is there a jury of colleagues or industry experts or how is that done? Uh, there is a jury. Uh, we've got five teams and uh, we've got team leads of the jury and uh, head of the jury. So all the projects uh, evaluated. We've got a lot of criteria, so we just check them, submit them and uh, um, how to say <laughs> and find the winner of the competition what, what do the winners get is there a prize or an award or yeah there are benefits not only for the winners for example if you're not winning the project so um, there is a benefit like uh, the project information and about the company will be uh, placed in our site and for the winners there are a lot of benefits it's uh, diplomas for the client and for the partner as well um, there is some trophies. Uh, there is we do publish information in very, very, very famous sources. For example, like last year's it was uh, Forbes, the Insider. Uh, we are advertising partners' project in social media. Uh, we provide the possibility to use the uh, competition slogger uh, on the partners' website, his materials, etc. And, and the final thing, uh, we um, cover. Um, there will be. Um, uh, award ceremony in Dubai. It will be on August, oh, October 9, sorry. And uh, all partners' expenses for one person will be covered by us. Wow, that sounds fantastic. Excellent. Thank you so much for the information. All right. Thanks, Valerie. All right. Let's see who else we can find here on the floor. We have Mielta Technology here. Excuse me. How are you doing? Could you present our fuel level sensor to our partner from, uh, from I think, uh, some of African country, yeah. Okay, excellent. What can you tell us about your product? We tell how to use them from the mo mobile app. It's a BLE Bluetooth uh, fuel level sensors, yeah. We manufacture it in Russia, in Tambov town, yeah. Okay. What do you think sets apart your product from the competition? Uh, I think uh, competition is very high, <laughs> yeah, but uh, some, uh, we have some features uh, and other guys have some features, but it's uh, uh, for the opinion of the client, I think. Uh, they, they, they should to choose what, what kind of uh, uh, devices they have to promote and uh, sell to these partners. Yeah. Great. And if anyone out uh, watching today wants to reach you, how can they reach out to your company? Uh, you can call me <laughs> if you want, yeah. Or uh, send me an email. Hey, what's your website? Website is Mielta Technology. Uh, Mielta.ru Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much for the interview. All right. Let's see who else we have here. We have a presenter from yesterday, Manuel Mendoza. He's talking to someone, so we're going to skip over here and come to Sensata. How are you doing? Hey, hello, how are you? Good, good. Can you uh, introduce yourself and your company? If yeah, sure. My name is Vitis. I'm from uh, Sensata Technologies, Cirgo Global. 
I'm from the technical support department. Excellent. And I know Sensata has a number of brands now, uh, including some recent acquisitions. Can you speak a little about that? Uh, yeah, we have like a couple of companies in the Sensata group. So you can see all those companies here. It's a Smart Witness, Schrader, uh, Preco, and Xergo Global. Okay. Can you just uh, speak a little as to what each one does? Or what they're so uh, Xergo Global is uh, oriented in telematics uh, solutions. Uh, Smart Witness is producing uh, cameras. Uh, Preco uh, is producing uh, radar systems for, for fleet. And Schrader is a tire pressure monitoring system as producer. They produce. So is this one of the new Smart Witness cameras here? Can you talk a little about this? Yeah. Uh, actually, they have a couple of cameras. So they have this camera with a front-facing camera. Uh, it has uh, the ADAS system in it, uh, and this one is a more advanced one. This has like two cameras. It has uh, uh, one camera for front camera and uh, the driver camera. Great. And I know there are a lot of cameras out here on the market. Uh, what do you think sets your cameras apart from the competition? Well, the quality, obviously, like it, it's top quality product. Excellent. Thank you so much. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right. Let's see who else we have here. Come over to Mechatronics. How you doing? Hi. Thanks. We are fine. Yes. Uh, you tell, introduce your company and tell us a little about yourself and the company. Thanks. We are Mechatronics and uh, we are like technology geeks because uh, there is no enough space to to place all our flyers, possible products. And uh, we are here to establish ourselves like uh, one stop of uh, to buy uh, sensor measurement solutions for fleet telematics. Uh, we develop uh, main areas of uh, measurement like full consumption monitoring, axolot sensors, temperature measurement, and some solutions for special monitoring telematics, special machinery telematics. Thank you very much. Can you tell us uh, what your website is or how people could get in contact with you if they're interested in your products? Our website is Mechatronics Buy. And uh, you can find us. Uh, we have YouTube channel. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All right. We have, let's come over to Sky Patrol here, David Moreno. David, how you doing? Good, sir. You're good. Doing all right. Would you mind uh, introducing yourself again for the online audience and what uh, Sky Patrol is all about? Sure. Uh, I'm David Moreno. I represent Sky Patrol. We are a US-based company. We are focused on biometric services and some special and, uni and unique features uh, in order to promote this kind of technology as the latest option for driver ID. We believe that facial recognition could be the key to avoid um, fraud prevention. That's the idea. So we decided to move here to the heart of Europe and start working with Gurtam and the IoT universe. Excellent. And what kind of products do you have here? What, what do you think sets these apart from uh, your competition? Well, basically, we do have some special devices here. One of them is this electronic lock. This is a 4G GPS lock. Um, what is unique is that we are using these NFC tags in order to unlock this device. Once you scan the device when you're up, you're going to be able to unlock You receive a list with some people that you previously authorized. Let's say that you are Enzo Ferrari. You're going to receive like a phone call. You answer that phone call. The front camera is going to be open. So let's say you are Enzo Ferrari. You need to smile and blink. Smile. Again. In order to avoid fraud, you need to smile, do the movement, otherwise it's not going to make it. So, once it's going to take a selfie of you, 
if you are Enzo Ferrari, you are going to be able to unlock this device. No, unfortunately, you are not Enzo Ferrari. Let's say that I'm Enzo Ferrari. So let's try it again. I know I, I doesn't look like Enzo Ferrari, but let's try. Once the selfie is complete, the identity should be verified. I'm Enzo Ferrari, actually. So the app is going to confirm to Gurtam that, yes, the guy is the right guy. So Gurtam is sending a command to this device, and you're going to be able to unlock the product. This technology can also be useful for driver ID, relays, a lot of things. That's the focus of the Sky Patrol. Wow, thank you so much for the uh, demo. That was fantastic. <laughs> uh, what's your website? How can people get in touch with you? Oh, it is skypatrol.com. We are a US, US based in Florida, a US company based in Florida, and we are happy to assist every customer in Europe and around the world, of course. Excellent. Thank you so much, David. Appreciate it. All right. Here we are at Escort. Uh, if you remember Tim, Tim spoke yesterday at our conference. Tim, nice to meet you. Yeah, likewise, likewise. Thank you so much. Could, thank you. Uh, could you actually uh, introduce yourself again and the, the company for the audience if they didn't see your presentation yesterday? Uh, yes, sure. Um, the company is located in Kazan, Russia. Uh, this is actually a full-scale production uh, line of the IoT and telematics devices. So from idea to concept to development to mass production, we do it all. We also have offices uh, in India and uh, we are exploring the opportunity of manufacturing our sensors in India as well. So that's uh, to optimize the cost and obviously to expand uh, worldwide. So uh, what we manufacture, we manufacture fuel level sensors, angle sensors, we manufacture uh, temperature, humidity, weather station, gas analyzers. So this is, uh, we are hardware guys, basically. What we do is a hardware. Um, one of the things uh, from the software side, what we have, we have a designated app that could be used uh, to configure the sensors. Uh, so tank calibration, for those who are familiar with fuel monitoring, uh, tank calibration, full and empty calibration, uh, loading up the black box, setting up the settings, and everything could be done via the app. So that means for those who know, that means you don't have to give your laptop to the technicians to bring in the field and do it in the rain, in the snow. So that's one of the advantages. Uh, and yes, we are mostly designated and dedicated towards the wireless technologies. This is what we think is the future. Uh, you know, thinking of Bluetooth not as something your watch or your headphones are connected to your phone, but as an industrial standard. So long story short, here it is. Excellent. Thank you so much. What do you think uh, distinguishes you from the competition? Oh, well, I mean, uh, first of all, we are the first ones to introduce the wireless fuel level sensors. It was about four years ago, uh, and uh, it was met with certain, uh, I mean, healthy amount of skepticism due to the fact that, as I mentioned, you know, people would think of Bluetooth something non-industrial, you know, and even like... Uh, I, I, I heard some comments like, if I come to the installation with the phone, it's not serious, I have to bring the laptop, I have to look professional. So, but other people disagree, they just go into the lighter, faster installation, you know, as much, as easy as uh, we can to make it for the integrator, for the installer, we try to do it this way, you know. And also our CEO, he started about 12 years ago as the installer of the fuel level sensor, so we know it, we know our hardware. So that's, that's about it. Thank you so much. And how can anyone uh, reach you from home that's watching? Well, uh, you can go to the website, escortsensors.com. Uh, so the phone number is there of, the, uh, of our India office, uh, but it could be easily redirected back to the designated managers. Also, we have a representation in Lithuania. Uh, the company is called Monito. Uh, the website is uh, monito.lt. So you are able to, uh, to procure our equipment in the uh, European Union from them as well. Excellent. Thank you so much, Tim. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's come back and see if we can go back to Quecklink since they were helping someone last time we were over here. Kim, how you doing? We're here with Quecklink. Uh, Manuel Mendoza Bravo gave a presentation yesterday. And they're currently, currently still talking to customers, so maybe we'll find someone else first so we don't interrupt. Maybe we can come over to Teltonica. Let's see. Hello. How you doing? Would you mind introducing yourself and your company for the viewers at home? 
Yeah, sure, we can. So we are Teltonica Telematics and uh, we are based in uh, Lithuania here in Vilnius. Our headquarters are and also our manufacturer site is also here. So we produce devices here in Lithuania and basically we have all R&D team and uh, a lot of professional people working inside the company to bring the best uh, telematic products to to the customers worldwide. And uh, basically this year we are focused most on the video solutions like uh, ADA systems for the aftermarket, uh, dual cam, uh, so uh, making the point on the video as this is actually going the very high request from uh, different partners all over the world and in plus uh, as we work more than 20 years in the market we have a variety of 2G products and now the best sellers uh, we are um, introducing with the 4G and cut and one technology so basically we can cover all over the world with different needs of the connectivity certificates and uh, different use cases. Excellent. Do you have the dual cam here or any other new products that you might be able to show us? Yeah, sure, of course. Just a second. Yeah. So this is uh, actually the dual cam. So we have uh, two cameras. One is w watching the road and another one is uh, made for watching what's happening inside the vehicle. So this is uh, made for uh, based on event you can download the video and check what was happening. So it's not live data, but uh, still you can get access to the recording pieces and uh, compare them with the events to understand better what was happening on the, on the road and during the driving behavior on specific moments. And uh, just a second. And this is the ADAS, the aftermarket solution, so it has a a display for the driver. So, for example, the cars that don't have uh, the ADA SIM built inside, still uh, for the understanding the better the driving behavior, uh, you put the camera on the windscreen, which can recognize the um, speed signs, uh, the distance between a uh, vehicle in front. Uh, so, like uh, uh, helping the driver understand if he is behaving badly so you got the notification for the driver on the display and in plus the main feature is that all the events coming to the platform and uh, using Vialon you can see those events understand that the driver is doing bad so you can get more, more professional and more precise driving rating on that side and also from the camera you can get also some sort of the, some parts of the videos so it's a very um, interesting solution and uh, specifically for the cars that don't have ADAS in built. Excellent, thank you so much. What is it that you think uh, sets Teltonica apart from your competition? Well, first of all uh, for many years we are in this business and we started from the module manufacturing and uh, then we got to the telematics. So we have all uh, the technology inside. So we have a very huge know-how. We have uh, a big professional team on the R&D, on the development side, construction. So we don't have any outsourcing. So everything is done inside the company. It's uh, done by professional people, the talented people, and we uh, invest a lot. Even though uh, Teltonica has plans that we already started to uh, bring to life, uh, we want to produce and the semiconductors here in Lithuania. So we are working a lot to bring in the best uh, from the uh, electronic field to the technology. Excellent. And how can uh, anyone get in touch with you? What's your website or? Yeah, sure. So uh, we have our uh, website, it's uh, teltonica.lt, so it's the main site where you can uh, get understanding of the whole Teltonica group, as uh, Teltonica IoT has not only telematics field, it has another field, and specifically for the telematics, we also have the dedicated website, so Teltonica Telematics, uh, but basically just going to the main Teltonica site, you will get all the links to our old businesses, and you get more information, the contacts, and, and so on. Excellent. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Let's see who else we can talk to. We have Reptella down here. Excuse me. 
Hello, Mr. The Ruptella team. How are you? Very good. How are you today? Excellent. Would you mind introducing yourselves and your company? Absolutely. So, sorry. Can I take it? Sure. <laughs> Fully on, yeah. Okay. <laughs> no. So my name is uh, Vincent, and I'm the regional sales manager uh, looking after for UK, Ireland, and Benelux countries. And here's my colleague. Uh, yes, my name is Aksana. I'm from Ruptela Company, head of region to Asia and Africa. Really, it's really for us in order to participate in Gurtam. Basically, for me, it's for the first time, and yes. for him as well to participate in this uh, conference. It's really very well, great organized, very nice speeches, very nice your introduction from your side, very, very nice speeches of all the participants. Thank you for uh, allowing us to participate in this. We are really, really happy. And good and business opportunities, most Yes, of course. Thank and uh, good business opportunities, most importantly. Yesterday we had a quite a successful day, met quite a lot of new clients. And the best part is, you know, all our devices are working great with Waylon. And your technical team is great in terms of supporting integrations and so on. So it works really well for us. Like currently when I was speaking with a client, so they are a Waylon partner. And now your technical team is basically working on integration. So the flexibility and things really helps us to support each other and it's an immense. Uh, can you tell me a little bit about maybe one of your latest products, one of the ones you have here? Here it is. Yeah, <laughs> this, this is our HTV5 light device, our advanced device, the top one. 4G device, so our company right now is having main focus on 4G connectivity. Yeah. So that's why we see that in many countries, unfortunately, there is such a tendency that they are shutting down 2G and they are moving to 4G. So that's why our main focus is 4G devices, both advanced and we have light part. Yeah, Trace yeah, is exactly five. Trace so. five. Um, so we have two, two different kind of devices. So one is this is for the Europe region and then is for the Latin and North South American part. So both have the same connectivity, 4G, LTE, CAT1, and this is CAT M1. So because of the uh, suitability of all the partners that we work with, so that we work really. And, and the best part is they are master devices, so you do not have to have 10 different devices to have certain functionality. You have under one roof all LCV, HCV, TACO, and it's incredible. And competitive pricing as well. So, so yes, do contact us. <laughs> Excellent, thank you. So what do you have to say to the, the viewers at home who maybe they're weighing a Reptella device against some of the competition, what, what's your message to them? Sorry, could you please repeat? What's your message to those who are thinking about buying a Reptella device versus maybe some of the other devices out there? Um, I would highly recommend, personally what I really like is uh, is the, the love and care that we show to our partners, the attention to details, uh, very flexible in terms of uh, creating the device, working closely with the development team, but or in a nutshell, I would say we offer first-hand support. So from the day one, we will be working with your extended team. So you know the, all the pain points. You don't have to go with the booklets to the protocol in, installations and so on. Everything is done with hand-holding. So our team will gonna be suggesting, helping you with everything overall. So, and that's all sorted. <laughs> Uh, just wanted to add that we're a really client-centric company. It's very important for us to have appreciation of our clients, to make them uh, satisfied with our goods, with our products that we're delivering. It's very important for us. Yes. Thank you so much. And how can uh, anyone get in touch with you? There. What's your website? Um, so yes, we do have a website. So we have a live chat option. So over there, you can simply put an inquiry, and it will gonna automatically reach to the designated person. Or you can always email us or call us. I think so. That's the best part. You know, we are, our information is all available all around. So so it's easily. And and then our uh, SLAs, our response rate is quite quick as well. Even for technical queries or for normal uh, new inquiries as well. So we aim to deliver between three to eight hours, which is incredible anyway. So yes, thank you. Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, you too. All right, we're here now with GPS Trace, which is a Gertum product. And we have Veronica and Rostislav. Rostislav just gave a presentation in our main hall. But if you didn't catch it, uh, would you mind introducing yourselves and what GPS Trace is all about? Uh, GPS Trace is a set of solutions for personal monitoring. Uh, for personal tracking, uh, we now we have an application for uh, cars, pets. We'll have uh, an application for uh, personal mobility, and uh, we are now on the on our first steps to the partners. So it 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 is a great 
it is a great possibility for us just to present our product to our partners. Thank you very much. Excellent. Uh, anything else you want to let the audience at uh, home know about GPS Trace or future products? We've got Petavik, Ruavik. I mean, As I what's what's. As I said, we will have Ihavik, and we will just now on our first steps to the partners, so we are now collecting the opinions, and the future will be on the next telematics, on 2023. We will, we will be there, and we will, I think, be, uh, came to the come to the partners with the new solutions and uh, new suggestions and new offers. Excellent. Looking forward to it. See you next year. Thank you, Andrew. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, we have Pod Group over here. Michael Chakal. Michael, how you doing? I'm well, thanks. How are you? Doing all right. Would you mind introducing yourself and tell us a little bit about Pod? Sure. Uh, Pod Group is a Gizeka Devriant company. Um, we are. Uh, we've been in business for 20 years, making and leaders in M2M IoT connectivity. We last year we were acquired by Gizeka Devriant, the leading manufacturer of SIM cards globally. So, and the interestingly is they invented the SIM cards 30 years ago and invented eSIM management 10 years ago. And now, they are also the leading vendors of SIM cards globally, but primarily they were targeting mobile operators. By adding our connectivity, we're together we're going to enterprise, delivering the SIM cards with connectivity directly to enterprise. Excellent. What do you think are the primary advantages of a, uh, say, a wheel-on partner, for example, using Pod Group over some other option out there? Well, we positioning ourselves also. We are an MVNO, but we're positioning ourselves as an enterprise network operator, very much focused on enterprise, and we offer one SIM for all solutions. How we achieve that is a one SIM could have multiple profiles. Each profile would be a multi-network profile, very powerful, and it's also future-proof because it is all our SIMs, even plastic pluggable SIMs, are eSIM manageable. That means that in future we'll be able to replace any profiles with future profiles that are not available today, but we're embedding the ability to update it remotely in the field without having to call back the devices. Excellent. So for those out there who want to reach out to Pod Group, how should they contact you? <laughs> contact me, michael.chakal at podgroup.com. So that's M-I-C-H-A-E-L dot C-H-A-C-K-A-L at podgroup.com. Excellent. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Great. Let's see if we can get back to QuickLink. Okay, we have Manuel Mendoza Bravo here. Manuel, how you doing? Good, good, yeah. <laughs> Manuel gave a presentation yesterday on our main stage. And so for those who didn't see your presentation, can maybe you uh, introduce yourself and the company and tell us a little bit about what's going on with yeah. Quecklink. Uh, I'm Manuel Mendoza, as you, as you said. Uh, I'm located here in Vilnius. Uh, and I, I take care of the European market for, for Quecklink. I'm sales manager. And uh, here are my colleagues also, uh, I, 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 Ivan also from Servi also sales and Chris from our technical support team. So, so yeah, we're here presenting our products. Yesterday we, we showed this, if, you, if, if the partners didn't see the presentation, we, uh, we spoke about the trailer tracker and some massive trackers that we also have here. Um, so yeah. What, what can you tell us about the camera over here? Yeah, this uh, new product we have, it's already integrated in, in, in Wilder. Uh, it's the first time that we release a, a camera product, so it's a dual uh, connected dash cam. Um, so yeah, it's a standalone product. It already has a, uh, the GPS inside, like two, two cameras, one for the robot, one for the driver, and uh, pretty much all the features that we have on the on the trackers for the driver behavior, accident detection, uh, yeah, and pretty much like you, you you configure to retrieve videos automatically based on uh, uh, pre-configured events. Uh, you know, like accidents, like harsh be uh, behavior, things like that. And yeah, we're pretty happy with the product. Excellent, excellent. I see you've got your top 10 GPS hardware manufacturers award here. This was presented yesterday. And so what do you think accounts for your success with Wheelon partners across the globe? Why are they choosing Quecklink 
over their competition? What makes it stand out? I, I mean, one that I mean, as you can see, we have a pretty broad uh, portfolio for uh, you know different applications. So, and we have device for all connectivity, like 2G, 3G, 4G. Now we're focusing more uh, on, on the LTE devices. Uh, so yeah, and now we're also presenting some of the new, just launched uh, products on Cat One uh, connectivity. So you know, like we have uh, devices for every application, uh, and also some products that are different from from the competition. You know, so so of course, like uh, whatever the partners need, we have something. And also, you know, like uh, Wylan also recommends us a lot. They, when the company see uh, the, the partners see that we're on the top ten, like they, they trust, you know, they they can work with us. So I mean, we're already well known in the market. So it's, yeah, we don't need to introduce the company that much, you know. So yeah. excellent. Thank you so much. Uh, good luck and uh, continued success. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. All right. I think we're down to a couple left who we haven't spoken with. We have. Teltonica Mobility over here. All right, Gediminas from Teltonica Mobility. How are you? Pretty fine. What about yourself? Oh, we're doing all right. Enjoying the uh, expo here. Would you mind uh, introducing yourself and your company for those at home? Yes, sure, of course. So basically, I know if you've heard of Teltonica, probably you did, but uh, we are totally different than uh, from telematics department, and uh, we are Teltonica Mobility which concentrates and we are concentrating on electric mobility as well as uh, uh, personal trackers here, what we have, and uh, most importantly, uh, the asset tracker. So this is our latest addition to the family. Uh, we have launched uh, the asset tracker last year in September, I think, and uh, this year we will be launching the LTE tracker. Uh, which will cover the rest of the world, uh, including the Asia, Middle East, as well as Latin America, North America, most importantly, I think, uh, because the customers are eager to get the LTE version of uh, our tracker. So these are the main three business verticals that we are developing. Once again, the electric mobility for uh, kick scooters, e-bikes, kick e-bikes, uh, kick scooters, all the electric, electric forklifts, electric rickshaws. So these are the... Uh, solutions that we deliver with uh, extended voltage up to 99, up to 97 uh, voltage, and as well as uh, personal tracking for uh, people safety, for uh, uh, loan worker safety, pet tracking. Uh, so it's like for, for, for you guys on the Petovic, so that's also integrated over there. And uh, as well as uh, so I mentioned electric and uh, finishing up with the asset tracking. So those are the main verticals what we have. Well, this is the one of the cool features and uh, one of the newest additions to the, I don't say, accessories. Mm -hmm. So we have this uh, one of a kind. I didn't see anything in the market like that. So this is the magnetic holder, which is developed for our tracker. So we can simply put it out anywhere you like. So you've seen that magnetic everywhere in the market. But what I want to speak about is this little small piece over here, which is uh, tamper detection. So either you remove the tracker, it sends you the notification. Either you remove the whole tracker with the holder, it sends the notification because this piece leaves behind. So the smallest distance from the tracker gets you the notification. So it's called the whole sensor. And uh, we are very happy to have that uh, released as well. Another solution is uh, with our friends from Telematics, what we did. It's the stolen vehicle recovery, SVR. So you can put this tracker, whatever in your car you like, and you get that uh, position tracking and uh, monitoring. And uh, in communication with the Bluetooth from the main tracker, so these are two communicating with the main tracker, and you cut the wires of the main tracker. This wakes up and uh, goes in the recovery mode to tell you where your tracker and where your car is. So that's the main uh, joint solution with telematics. So yeah, these are the three business verticals what we have. And uh, that's it. I Excellent. took the most of the time here, but yeah, you have questions. Maybe guys over there has some questions. Yeah, no, this is excellent. Now, we've got the uh, e-bike over here, right? Is this what we, the Teltonica e-bike over here? No, it's, it's not Teltonica e-bike, actually. Yeah. 
I'll you tell you more. Yeah, I'd like to hear more about it. I see the Teltonica logo on there. Yeah, I, I just put the sticker over there. <laughs> yeah, but basically, uh, as I mentioned, the electric uh, vehicles, electric yeah. bikes. So this is one of our newest addition to the family, LTE device, uh, which will be covering the electric mobility market. And uh, this one over there, uh, factory fitted unit. So this device, this small piece, uh, can read the battery level, battery percentages, driven distance, driven distance to drive, lock on lock, turn on, turn off the lights, brakes. You can have the uh, maintenance over there, renew the firmware of the bike itself through this tracker. So this small piece does all the job. So we see that this will be the market breaker for the electric bikes because you know the boom of electric bikes currently going through the roof. Yeah, so this is our one of the most anticipated devices that we are delivering. And this is the new one uh, that we are delivering in the market right now. Excellent. And how can anyone get in touch with you if they're interested in your products? Simply go to teltonica-mobility.com and see what we have over there. Also, you can, uh, I don't know how to say, you can come into the Gortam uh, <laughs> website, you see Teltonica Mobility, but don't... Uh, Mix, mix us up with telematics. We are separate division uh, doing these separate trackers. So I don't know, probably most of you didn't knew that we existed because we are pretty new here in this market and trying to get our places. So Teltonic as a brand helps us to do that. Excellent. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys. We're coming to a close here at the IoT Software and Hardware Expo. Maybe we can check one more booth here at Technoton. We have a cat arena over here. Excuse me, guys. Excuse me. Hi, Katarina. How are you? I'm okay. Thank you. Good. Would you mind introducing yourself and telling us a little about your company? Um, company Tichnaton. My name is Ekaterina Mandrik, and uh, we present the fleet management solutions for for the cars, ships, locomotives, railway. So. Here it is. I can tell a few words, yeah? Please do. You might. <laughs> so uh, here is the level sensors that uh, control the fuel in the tank, uh, fuel in, draining, uh, fuel flow meters with which we can uh, show information about the fuel consumption and engine working time, uh, axle load sensors uh, to control the axle load and the weight of the cargo. Uh, and contactless readers with which we uh, receive all the information from the CAN bus. In brief. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you so much. What do you think uh, sets your products apart from the competition? Um, I think that uh, we can compete and um, the, the conference is a very good uh, place where we can show all our solutions, uh, devices and our uh, advantages. Excellent. And how can the uh, viewers at home get in touch with your company? Uh, uh, What's your website or best contact information? Yes, of course. We, we, we have the website and all the contacts. Uh, you mean how you... What's the actual website? Yeah, so they can find you. It is the same. This is tishnaton.com or LV. So, okay. yeah. Excellent. Thank you so much for your time. You too. Bye. All right, guys. That's it from here. Uh, thank you for watching Wheel On Action News, and we'll be getting back to the conference shortly after lunch. Thank you so much.